Hello, I greet you with peace. This is Jack Lukman. Does this scenario resonate with you? You sneeze, use a tissue or handkerchief to clean your nose. You then put it in your bag or pocket, etc. Or maybe you throw it on the floor because that's the easiest disposable option. You then sneeze again <laughs> and repeat the process. You may not have easy access to wash your hands. When the eyes become itchy, you use the same hands to rub your eyes. When a friend approaches, you give him or her a wonderful handshake, thereby spreading the love Oh, sorry, spreading the gems. As a young man, this scenario resonated with me. I'm talking about over 40 years ago. You may ask, what's the business idea? Well, there are health and safety issues here. More especially as we've learned with the COVID-related experiences. The idea is to create a disposable or reusable bag. This could be in different sizes. It could be made from cloth or from suitable other materials. As you sneeze, you could put the used tissue or handkerchief in the bag. The bag could be opened or closed via the use of a pull string as the bag is collapsible. You could then insert this into a bigger bag as necessary and either dispose of it or if it as if it's disposable or you wash it if it's reusable. It's a simple solution to a big problem. You could do the business solely or collaborate with others. This product will be, will be beneficial to the Qatar Republic, those who suffer with sneezing. I have been a member of this Republic for almost 60 years. There are probably so many millions of people like me all over the world. In addition to helping us become more responsible, quote unquote, you are helping create a healthier environment as well as a healthier world. You shall also be creating wealth and jobs. The problem of Qatar has been generational. If it's not curable, maybe we could at least manage it. I hope that you found value. If so, please like and share this video. Also, please consider subscribing to this channel. This is Jack Lukman. Ireo, I wish you blessings.